Hey, so this is the Witch's Archives. I'm James, a production designer, and I'll show you around. So we are in the small section of the congregation, which is looked after by the witches. So keen-eyed viewers will recognise some of these bookcases. So these, we borrowed these from the Bodleian Library. So now we've finished with that set, it's time to reincarnate it into something different. So this is based around a Renaissance Museum of Curiosities. So everything here from scrolls and a lot of the books and many of the other sort of grimoires and other sort of spell books have been all made by our team here. Aleri and Lucy and Roz have put together all of these amazing things. So a lot of the stuff has been made specifically for this set and then some of the other things have been hired in. So some skeletons and some various bits of taxidermy and bottles with snakes in them and eels and all sorts of things. Above your head up here is a nice little crocodile which the witches might take little pieces off for some of their spells. So then this room becomes a sort of common room for want of a better word. So this is where they sort of hang out and they do a lot of their research and they might pull various books and archives out. So this is where they come and sit and hang out and they've got their little computer here and then all of these little drawers here, all these nice little labels on are all filled with little bits of magic. Over here, look, we've got a nice little cupboard full of curiosities of eels and snakes. And then we go around and all the way through this room then is filled with all sorts of stuff. These are local newspapers that have all been cut up and wrapped in order to help bulk out the area. Um, and then a lot of the other stuff, these are polystyrene books which have been recovered. So these were once in the Bodleian Library. There's no proper ceiling on this room. We try and build all the sets as high as we can really. An awful lot of lights in here to give us this nice glow. The floor again is a good solid floor, so everyone that walks in here feels like it's a real nice antique space. And then through these curtains down the far end, they go through to other areas of the archive. And then we've got this beautiful round table which sees a fair odd amount of action with Satu being thrown across it. 